Yo, what is good, YouTube? Welcome back to another JC2K video. In today's video, we're doing gameplay with a hidden gem Billy Owens diamond card. Um, I think Billy Owens has had a card in my team before a couple years ago. I feel like I remember him getting one, but it's been a while. And this card on paper is really interesting. He is a 6'9 elite defensive shooting guard who's got a lot of versatility and looks like one of the best hidden gems, period. I think he, despite not being a huge name, looks like one of the very best hidden gem cards out of all of the diamond hidden gems and i'm excited to try this card out so before we hop into the video if you haven't already make sure you hit the subscribe button help me push towards the 40,000 subscriber mark on the channel i upload every single day tons of consistent daily my team content would really appreciate it if y'all do subscribe and without further ado let's hop right into it billy owens by the way massive shout out to my boy anthony as well for letting me hop on his account to record this game but he got billy owens out of his um hidden gem pack this weekend so pretty nice poll there a 6'9 shooting guard elite size that in of itself provides real value 95 offense 94 defense a 83 ball isn't insane 80 driving dunk also not insane 86 ball handle is solid the defensive stats are good but they don't jump off the page at you is insane either 87 speed 87 agility 84 speed of ball 85 vert 82 strength 96 stamina super solid statistically but nothing too game changing off post riser physical finisher lightning launch and strong handle this is what is really interesting about this card 100 dunk tendency and not only 100 dunk tendency but his defensive tendencies he has let's see what his defensive tendencies are a 98 pass interception 98 on ball steal 98 contest and 98 block shot tendency and a five foul tendency so he's barely going to foul and he's going to have incredible on ball te defensive tendencies he's got did he add badges he added a dead eye lim or he added limitless shifty shooter brick wall box up beast and rebound chaser so definitely would add limitless and shifty shooter i would agree with that for sure uh also has dead eye slippery off ball bailout break starter unpluckable post lockdown challenger off ball pest pick dodger glove interceptor um set shot specialist on ball menace high flying and iron paint patroller really nice card honestly maybe would he, he should have added handles for days handles for days and movable enforcer and dimer are all must adds in my opinion definitely would get those on him uh in fact not having handles for days is kind of a big issue to be completely honest with this card like i would much much rather have handles for days than box up beast i'm just going to swap that one real quickly just that just that one badge right there um and i do think i mean billy owens is going to be really really good uh, the thing about this card is six nine at shooting guard provides size that is rare for sure uh, i gotta make sure these settings are where i want them to be real quickly why is it on difficulty play based real player percentage let me get this stuff right um i have like so many settings i have to adjust apparently but the card i mean six nine shooting guard big player build look you see that immediately he looks like a power forward so that's that's a big thing to start off with i have my re jump meter on, my release on right now but uh i mean the jump shot is butter so especially with shooting bad is added he's going to be really nice as an athlete uh obviously of course as well and he's going to be really good as a slasher and defensively is where he's going to get his best plus he's got incredible size so the stats aren't game changing but i think overall his animations are really really good and um that combined with the size is just like something that's going to really help elevate this card now it's behind that his drag back isn't great it doesn't create a ton of space and it's not super fast um but his jumper is really nice he's a very capable athlete he's got that elite level size with some really good finish ability as well and defensively he should be i mean as good as it gets pretty much at this point in the year especially with how good his defensive tendencies are those are going to help elevate the card i think as a whole you've got yourself an elite elite level shooting guard in my team if you get this hidden gem billy owens because that size just something you can't teach this card's gonna be really good i'm excited to use them let's hop into a game let's see what billy owens can do all right, we are hopping into a salary cap game in this one just because I didn't really feel like playing a full showdown game, to be totally honest with y'all. So we're going to see what we can do. I think I still have the... I do. I have the meter on. Forgot to turn it off. My bad. All right, jab step. Reject the screen. Attack downhill. Look how big he is. Even if... I, I missed that. That's my bad. Um, but look, I mean, six foot nine versus six foot... Like, he looks... He's as big as Clint Capella. This dude's got power forward center size at the shooting guard position. That more than anything else initially just provides elite level value um this dude's salary cap team is not that great though i think we actually are in a pretty favorable matchup here we're gonna have him guard a diamond purvis because that's his best card and uh look at matisse thibel with the defense beautiful stuff swing it to the corner catch and i should have just shot off the first one but i still graded off the pump fake good shot billy owens and he's got five quick ones beautiful stuff this card is really i wish i had him honestly because like small forward shooting guard whatever you need from him he can play both he can be your on-ball lock if you want him to be he's got a little bit of shot creation he's a really good catch and shoot shooter provides a lot of overall value i mean a lot of these hidden gym cards are good right this okay hold on what in the coach settings are they just subbed in 
Yo, this is all on auto. Okay, let's change all of this right now, please, because I don't want any um, auto subs in. That's not what I'm looking for, but I guess he's at small forward here, so we're going to play him at small forward for a, for a play. Um, catch here, drive the ball, drag back. I wish his drag back was a little faster. That's my main probably complaint so far with the card. Kick corner, catch and shoot. Jalen Brunson, green. I'm green with the meter. Beautiful stuff. Good shot, and we have ourselves a... Um, <clears throat> Eight to two lead so far, so not a bad start at all. He actually did get a blow by, but nope. Oh my goodness, he runs right past me until Billy Owens recovers and that very high block shot tendency coming into play right there. Stop, pop, Billy Owens. Ah, it's a good shot. I've missed it. I've made a few threes though, so I was kind of due to miss one, unfortunately. And we do miss that one right there, but it is what it is. Wall this up. He Loki has a dunk there with Capella, and he's got a layup as well. AD did not play that too well defensively, to be honest. Um, would like to get the starters all the way back in, so I have him at the three, two instead of the three, but that's fine. Hit the pop, pump fake, hit the slip. I have somebody wide open, and it's Lamar Odom. And Lamar Odom grains the three. Nice assist. We'll take that. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. He's got five points, one rebound, two assists to start off the game. That, in my opinion, is a very, very, very solid start. Good board, Lamar. Run the floor again. Swing it up to Stockton. Stocky poo out to Billy Owens. Billy Owens is matched up against Sapphire Lamarcus Aldridge. That's just not a very good matchup for him. And I got to green that one, man. That's tough. I thought I did green that one. I'm not going to lie. Um, jab step, jab step. I'm shooting over him. And I'm ah, I missed that too. I thought that was going to be green as well. Smoky right now, honestly. Steel, look at Ruby Stockton. Yes, sir. The shortest man on the court making a play. Love to see it. Catching the corner. Pump fake. Let's go baseline here. Hop step. Chill. Reset up top. We're good. And swing it over to... Oh, Brunson is now at my shooting guard position. This is, again, why I hate auto subs, because it'll just do random stuff, like put Brunson in my shooting guard position, which is obviously not what I'm really looking to do. Drive the baseline. Three seconds left in the shot clock. Get inside, and Billy Owens with the finish. Half physical finisher right there, which seems to be a pretty good badge this year. And he's got seven points, one rebound, and two assists in the first three minutes of this game. That is solid, and that's going to be not an A1. All right, I'm cool with that, because that means Capella has to shoot free throws, and he's probably going to miss at least one of them, because I don't think that Capella is a very good free throw shooter. Of course, as I see that, the first one goes in. Okay, whatever, we live. That uh, looked like it was going to miss for sure, but it didn't. And the second one does miss. All right, we knew that was probably going to happen, so that is totally good by me. Hit Billy Owens again, back it up, and now let's attack towards the right or to the left, back it out again, and let's see what we can do here. Jab, attack, hit the corner, catch and shoot. Great pass, great shot, beautiful offense. We are doing a great job so far of making the right play pretty much every single possession. And we have ourselves a 16 to five lead because of it. And he's gonna step out of bounds right there as well. This could be a very quick quit. I would not be totally shocked if this man decides to get up out of here pretty soon because we are kind of dominating. I'm loving what I'm seeing so far out of the out of the squad. Uh, drive the ball here again. Brunson get inside, pop out to uh, Billy Owens. This is oh, what I would call a massive mismatch. I'm gonna relax and I'm gonna take my assist we'll take that i was going to go up with it but instead we'll bail out and we'll get ourselves another assist he's got seven points one rebound four assists and a block in the first couple possessions of the game that is well not a couple possessions but the first few possessions of the game that is beautiful to be honest uh to this point in the game i'm very much liking what i'm seeing billy owens again oh yeah good d look at matisse oh my goodness emerald matisse style using that high steal rating making a play there as well we have an 18 to 5 lead. This is kind of an annihilation at this point. We are flooding this dude so far. Drive the ball again. Pop is open again. Catch and shoot. Billy Owens, 4 3. Green light. Oh my lord, he's looking tough. Uh, dominating this game right now, to be honest. We are just taking over, and he is playing phenomenal. Really liking what I'm seeing out of Billy Owens so far. One second left in the half. You don't have time for that job step anyway. A dominant first half, and I mean dominant. 21 to 5 lead is. About as good as it's ever going to get, to be completely honest. It's what we should be doing, considering our opponent's team isn't that great. But Billy Owens is showing what he can do, man, with the nice, smooth release, the athletic ability attacking the rim, the versatility to pass the ball a bit. And he finally gets scored on the first time this game that he is scored on there, uh, unfortunately, by that backdoor to purpose short. But a 21-7 to lead is still not too bad. Why did I just start skipping all of a sudden? I went from the game being completely smooth to all of a sudden I'm skipping like crazy. What is going on? I'm like so delayed all of a sudden what the heck that's ridiculous i don't know why this is happening uh hit the corner again get a pick and roll here with matisse i'm gonna come off this and shoot his fade i don't even know what his fade's looking like oh his fade is nice too this card is so good he is so nice i didn't even check his fade in freestyle he is so nice even with the skipping right now still able to green the fade we have a 23 to 7 lead this is really, really impressive. And Billy Owens, I mean, defensively, besides that one back door that he just gave to Purvis Short, he is looking phenomenal. Getting bumpy on Purvis. Beautiful defense. Help down here. That's fine. Yep, I'm cool. Good. Step up on Lillard. 
Get through the screen. Good. Play the back door. Yes. Good defense. Good defense. Sometimes you're just not going to get the paints up. That's my team. Not, not a lot we can really do about that. I thought that was pretty good defense again, so not too mad about it, even if the result is points for him. Pump fake, jab, and reject the screen. Attack downhill all the way inside. Billy Owens, I mistimed the layup. That was there, too. It wasn't an easy layup, but I got to time it better there because that one was going to probably go in if I had timed it better. Um, again, Billy Owens, you can't mash him. Like That's not going to happen. Six foot nine. His switchability and versatility defensively is, again, super valuable because he's... Look, he's Lamar Odom sized at the shooting guard position. Like that's just, that's a s amount of size that you just can't really replicate. There's only a couple of cards in the game that have even similar to size to that. Like for example, a Paul George, I just greened that and it gets swatted by Lamarcus. That's tough. But like he's 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 an inch taller than a Paul George or a Scottie Pippen. So that is really really valuable size again. And I think it's just hard to replicate that. Like there's one other hidden gem I think that's this tall, and I think it's uh, Franz Wagner can also play shooting guard, and he's six ten I believe. But uh, the overall versatility of this Billy Owens card, the fact that he is a very capable athlete, and the fact that he's got such a solid release and plays so much defense and all that just provides a ton of value. But at this point, he is kind of tired. So again, that's why handles for days being fully upgraded would be a nice badge to have for sure. Good D Matisse, make a play then, run the floor, stop and transition, green the three, and that is going to be the final play of the gameplay right there. 15 points, one rebound, four assists, six of 13, and three of seven from three. Billy Owens is looking absolutely phenomenal across the board as a hidden gem diamond. Very impressed by the card. Hope y'all did enjoy the video. If you did, make sure you hit that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe. I'll be back with more 2K content very, very soon, and I appreciate y'all. Peace.